Ha ha! Yay! Aqua Cure! <laughs> I am so happy they brought Aqua Cure back! And what is it? Escape to Ecstasy? It's physical fitness recovery. So it's like a supplement. Call me. Hello and welcome to Hexcrank Live. It's a special edition. The Resident Evil 3 demo came out today on the 20th here and it was an emergency. I could not stop myself from downloading and playing this. Playing the PC version. Hopefully I can stream and run this just fine. Hey there, Ben. Hey there, Snibbington. I like your name, Snibbington. It's a good name. Twilo, what it is. Cool. Um, so let's see. I know nothing about this aside from what it happened in the original, which they could and will use against me. Hi, Mary. Hi, Hoonigan. Can't save or load. Toy Uncle Super Shop. Oh, no. Oh, this is pretty yeah. far into the game. This fine young lady could use our help. Ooh. Is that Nikolai or Mikhail? Carlos, you didn't even think to ask fine young lady her name? She is an elite operative of RPD, Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Her name is something Valentine. It's Jill. Nice to meet you, Jill. I am UBCS, platoon leader Mikhail Victor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. Oh, Mikhail's the leader. I thought Nikolai was. How's that going for you? The city is completely cut off, isolated. Most of the 100,000 civilians will wind up dead. Uh, correction, undead. <laughs> My platoon has suffered serious losses. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. Well, you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get this subway train moving... They're on a subway train, not on a bus. This is really different. But we need help. My men cannot do this alone. I'm in. But I am on their side, not yours. Oh, hey. It's cool. We all want the same thing. Thank you, Jill. All Damn, right, this so game looks on. really good. Here you go. We can use this to stay in contact. I know what a radio is. Okay, first things first. We need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find supplies there. All right. Sorry about that noise. My mom messaged me something on Facebook. Okay. Shit, Kevin. They really took a chunk out of you. Nothing that I would miss. Okay, ammo crafting is here. <laughs> hey, there's wet fart on the battlefield. If you run out of ammo, your gun's about as useful as a wet fart. Want to stay alive out there? Then get these basic formulas into your skull. Okay, so no more of that A, B, C crap. Skull Stalker on the Red Planet. Skull Stalker, adrift in space. Lobster, Jim's Crab. Party, party, party. <laughs> oh yeah, Dr. Wiley and Dr. Light. People were sharing these on Twitter today. RE3. Astro Crunch. For cadets of all ages. And Biggie. Back home for a one night only. <laughs> Twilight says, little did they know that a wet fart in our current circumstances could wipe out 2% of the population. Wow. That is a very small inventory.
just that. Uh, let me see here. Freak Cinema, the year's top films. Sorry, I just... Obviously, a lot of care has been put into... Uh, has been put into these maps. Oh, see, electrical substation, police department, the parks. Yeah, it's all there. She will be bepouched. Bepouched. Tabloid front page. The Cannibal Murders, a complete digest. In the gray of the morning on September 25th, a frantic caller telephoned the RPD to report an assault. A man, described as disheveled like a vagrant, was attacking a nearby passerby, north of the Lambs Museum of Art. The responding officers discovered the mutilated corpse of a woman by some dumpsters nearby. Dozens of bite marks covered her body and she, seen she had been dismembered, suggesting she had been eaten. The third known incident of its kind would occur in Raccoon City this month. So, who done it? Who's been munching on manstape? <laughs> <laughs> we here at the News Comet have a gnawing feeling that the so-called cannibal disease patients Spencer Memorial has been providing free treatment for since August might not be settling for just the cafeteria food. Our reporters have infiltrated Spencer Memorial, asked the tough questions, and come back with the horror stories that will make your stomach royal. Turn the page for the scoop. Hey, Jala. Uh, Twilo asks, uh... So is this remake being set in the 90s, early 2000s? It's in 98, um, just like to me again. You top the originals. Working on it. So what's the plan? The old tanks got me clearing the tracks. You might get the subway infrastructure back online. And how do I do that? Let's start by restoring power. I'll navigate you to the substation once you hit the main road. Copy that. Let's do this fast. This is immediately less lonely uh, than to which tracks. There's my gunpowder. Hey, Jala. Thank you, Lord of Goats. I'm happy that the shows are helping you. Oh, hey, I recognize this. Take that, toy uncle. Herb field manual, I know that. Let's see, do we have anything resting in there? No, we don't. Yo, Jack! I hope everybody is doing okay this evening. Thank you for subscribing, Twilo. Oh shit, there's a dodge! Look at that! Hell yeah! Do I have a, do I have a melee that I can do? Can I do a, an immediate turnaround? I can do a turnaround. Oh. No, so this is not how the OG opens. Um, this is actually really far into the story. Uh, it opens with uh, with Jill kind of just plopping down in the middle of the city and heading toward... Uh, heading toward the police station. Thank you for the sub takedown. Okay. Ah, there we go. Thank you. Snivington gave me uh, gave me control advice for getting the knife out. Shit. There is no aim assist going on here. 
Uh, B Max says, FYI, no iframes. Oh, fuck. No iframes. Okay, so having the knife equipped does not necessarily stop you. Oh, you're gonna get back up? Yeah, no, these zombies are just as persistent as RE2. Stab that ass. Okay. Okay, those are zombs. What have we here? Sorry, I'm just I'm <laughs> Look at that Mega Man toy. It's like the like the shitty illustration on Mega Man 1. God. They know exactly how to service me as a fan. The substation's bigger than it was. You mean the alley that's on fire? Maybe. Surely a tall drink of water like yourself can put out a few flames. Fuck you. I like feisty Jill. Is feisty the bad word you see to use for that? Okay, I need some kind of some kind of tool. Let me do some. Okay, we're looking for a, uh... Ooh, Jack says, saw some bad takes about how Jill, quote, isn't nice earlier. Yeah, that is a shitty, shitty take. Well, there we go. So we're gonna have to dodge through these guys. Hi, Sirva. We got a lot of people here. Thank you for uh, for tuning in for this special occasion. I am enjoying this a lot so far. Oh, oops. <laughs> no. Okay. So the dodge is not as reliable as I uh, as I would have thought. Um, Dodd Nos Nos how far in are we? I'm only like 10 minutes into the demo, but this seems to be like two thirds of the, or a third of the way through the game. Moon Donuts, Blue Mountain Storehouse, Jim's Crabs. God, I am way into all these stores, guys. <laughs> So, something that is not necessarily the, the most known thing about RE, RE3. So, this takes place during the Raccoon City incident. Um, specifically, at least the original, uh, was split in two. There was the, um, the first part was the day before Resident Evil 2. And the second part, after Jill gets infected, spoilers... Um, is, uh, is the day after Resident Evil 2. Oh, fuck! I thought I stabbed you several times!
Let's see. Okay, Kite Brothers Railway. That might be the substation that I need to get into. It's lit up. Thank you for subbing, Jumi, Jumi Ilazel. Did I shoot his leg off? I think I did. They are not backing off on the shocking gore, which I'm a fan of. Let's see. Oh, dang. Yeah, fire hose. Good. Do I need a wrench now? Or is that enough? Subway employees memo. Violence getting worse and worse these past few days. Got a shotgun for when it hit a breaking point. Locking it up in the gun rack, that I should keep it safe from any would-be looters while I go out and try to find some more shells. If things go south, cut the chain and bust out that sucker. I pray we all make it back alive. Oh shit, I need a... I need a bolt cutter. My combat knife is not going to do it. Woof. Sweet. I'm gonna have to bust out the big scissors. Somebody took my big scissors. And no, I'm not persuaded by the argument. How could somebody take your big scissors, Cole? Nobody comes into your house but you. Somebody took them, okay? This must be the subway company's offices. Carlo! Nothing. All right, ensuring safe subway operations. In the event of a power outage, the subway will automatically cease operations. Once power has been restored, please use the control panel to confirm the stations at which the train will stop, as well as which track segments will be used. If the route entered is unsafe, an error will occur, so I guess once I restore the power, I need to come back here. Uh, that means that I will likely have the bolt cutters when that happens, and then I'll need, like, need to program in the route. So that is fine. Hey there, Deothor. Hmm. Okay. So I have the fire hose. Do I have what I need to attach the fire hose? Oh, fuck! Stop! 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 If you were a Silent Hill protagonist, you would have stomped, Jill. there. Critical hit. Good. Hey, 
Ha <laughs> ha! Yay! Aqua Cure! <laughs> I am so happy they brought Aqua Cure back! And what is it? Escape to Ecstasy? It's physical fitness recovery. So it's like a supplement. Call me. <laughs> 918, yay! <laughs> Where's the safe at? Choose your medicine carefully. I don't know that I would take a tablet from Umbrella that was labeled with a G. It doesn't seem like best practices. Where's the safe at? Come on. I'll need those later. They're, they're going to have to give me a, uh, a pouch at some point here. Mouthwash. Ooh, orange mint. Heinous. Eh, maybe I'll find it somewhere else. Eagle's Pet Shop. Uh, let's go up that fire escape. I'm loving these critical hits. I like how natural the pathfinding feels in this. Oh, they're fine. They'll burst out when I try and leave. Oh, no, okay. Yeah, sorry. Sleepy. Had a long day. Okay, I've been up there. Ah, damn. I need those bolt cutters bad. You're gonna get up. Yeah, I'll leave you here until I come back. These have to be, um... These locks are too ubiquitous and conspicuous. Hey! Bolt cutter, cool. Uh, but you can't save in the demo. I need to go back and uh, recover that ground because the bolt cutters will be uh, useful.
Shoulda, shoulda figured that would happen. Man, they are really generous with those, uh, with those red barrels. Thanks, DK. Hey, <laughs> you still got it. I forget. I think this is where the, uh... This is where the shotgun is. I just know that this is gonna take up two slots. Or maybe it won't. This is tricky. Yeah, I can't pick that up. Oh, well. It was extremely hard not to play this earlier, you guys. This is all first impression. I saved it for you. Ooh. And I forget where all the chains are. Yeah, no chains back here. And somebody has walked in behind me. Ooh, big boy. Looks kinda like uh looks kinda like Kyle Gas from Tenacious D. Love that dodge. Hello, John. Good morning. Where are you at that it's morning? Australia, New Zealand? Yeah. No, that has to be a thing in the, in the real game. Malaysia. Well, welcome from Malaysia. Oh no! He's using his tentacle arm as like a grappling hook. Holy cow. That. This is way different than Mr. X. Wow. Bud, I thought I could get away from you. Ah. 
Oh, okay. I didn't expect that to be over. Completion time. I just started three of the 20 dolls. Awesome. Well, I mean, I thought I would have more time for, um, I thought that I would have more time for impressions just to, just, just to go over stuff. Yeah, no, my, um, my, my, my thirst is, uh, I, yeah, no, I am, I am definitely thirsty for this one when it comes out. Uh, half hour is a good time for a demo. I like that quite a bit. Um, they're really justifying uh, this remake. Two is so, I mean, the common complaint about three is that it's too similar to two. That is not necessarily founded because it is a much more action heavy game. Uh, it's a much more crowded game because a lot of it takes place before the city is mostly evacuated or dead. Um, you know, because it takes place during the, uh, you know, during the day before, um, you know, and we see that here, we see more people, we see, you know, Mikhail's team and Carlos and all that. We see civilians running and it's not just people like, uh, you know, the, the police chief and what have you, or, you know, Kendo or whatever his name is. Um, you, you know, I was worried that they had captured enough of what was cool about Nemesis in the RE2 remake um, that a remake on of Nemesis here, it might seem too similar. Um, showing what they did here in this demo of Nemesis, you know, basically starting out by converting a zombie into like a mega tentacle Nemesis parasite zombie, that's a that like that's a game changer. Like all Mister X did was like push zombies out of the way. The fact that he could make areas more dangerous even after he is gone uh, is a huge deal. How mobile he is uh, when he you know uses his arm tentacles as a grappling hook, uh, that is a, a huge deal as well. You know, like it's going to be hard to run away from him. You know, um, so <laughs> yeah, I can see what somebody in the chat was talking about. Like, yeah, I got the shotgun, but I didn't really get a chance to. Uh, um, I didn't really get a chance to. Uh, use it because it is so, so short. Uh, BMAX says, already so cold, the banging door can be gone through if you don't pick up the hose so early. Uh, they wanted a railroad toward Nemesis. Yeah. Um, also, it'd be cool to find find out what happens when you find all the dolls. I'm going to read about that on a wiki. I do not go for collectibles. Um, I'm really jazzed. You know, <sighs> April the 3rd or whenever this comes out is like right around the corner. Uh, I hope so society is still around. That'd be cool. <laughs> but yeah, uh, Game Boner stoked. I uh, uh, really, really enjoy this. And at this point, I'm just rambling and gushing at the same time. Thanks, everybody, for hopping on at a non-standard uh, streaming time. I'm really happy with the number of people who are out here. Um, I'll be streaming more Evil Within 2 tomorrow and Saturday. Um, hopefully, I can get through it this weekend. If not, though, that's cool. Everybody, have a wonderful and safe you know, night and Friday and a weekend, all that. Take care of each other. We are all in this together. Bye bye. <laughs>